More than 240 million people worldwide were infected with malaria in 2020, and more than 600,000 died from their infections. Many live in areas of Africa where malaria is endemic. People who live in malaria endemic areas, unfortunately, they are all too familiar with malaria. They encounter malaria in some instances multiple times a year. Their children encounter malaria. They don't attend school. People are unable to attend work. They can't carry out their daily activities. But now doctors will have a new weapon to fight malaria. A new study led by the University of Maryland School of Medicine found that a three-dose vaccine regimen was safe and effective in West African adults. The rationale for giving multiple doses of a vaccine is that you initially prime the immune system with the first dose, and then there's the possibility of getting an increased and enhanced immune response with subsequent doses. The vaccine is made with a live attenuated form of the malaria parasite. In the new study, researchers wanted to reduce the number of required injections from five shots to three and improve its effectiveness. With malaria, it's very difficult to protect against the multiple genetic variants of malaria that exist in nature, particularly against Plasmodium falciparum, which is the biggest killer uh, of children in Sub-Saharan Africa due to malaria. The three-dose vaccine regimen also protects people who have experienced multiple episodes of malaria in their lifetime. So therefore their immune system was familiar with malaria. So you're, you're actually working to overcome that immune response and try and retrain the immune system to fight malaria in a different way. Researchers plan to conduct more clinical trials of the vaccine in children, travelers, military personnel, and pregnant women. For the University of Maryland School of Medicine, I'm Larry Roberts.